So are you guys do you guys know there's an election coming up, right? Oh yeah. Yep. What day is the election? Uh let's I have no clue. The only thing I know about politics right now is that Rob Ford's really sick. Are you are you planning to vote this elec uh, um, election? Um, no, no, I've never thought of it actually. I think you don't vote uh, probably because they feel their voices may not be heard. Youth aren't really attracted to the whole election type of thing. You know, they feel that it's boring or, you know, they feel like, oh, I'm still too young to vote. You know, they, they don't really know that they can have a say in this type of matter. I feel like you don't have really much of a choice. They're giving us, us the options, right? It's not like they tell, tell us to choose one, but yeah. they're giving us who to choose. So I don't really feel like I have a fair say in what really the outcome becomes. The majority of the youth that I know that don't vote probably just don't feel the need to. Plus a lot of false promises always, right? So not, really, not a lot of good testimonies. If, I, if elected, what I would do to get young people involved is just make sure they're engaged. Make sure there's places for them to go. Make sure we're talking about issues that matter to them. We make sure they understand who the leaders are, who their elected officials are, and have a connection to them. It's, it's one thing to know who they are, it's one thing to know them. Right? Yeah. And to make sure that young people know who they are and they're able to engage them directly. What, what do you think they need to do to get you more engaged in the future and more politically, become more politically aware and involved? I guess give the youth a reason to vote, you know, like maybe change something that is better for the youth. I can tell you, man. They have to come up with something. Like, they need to come up with something, right? They need to come up with something. And I believe that young people are not the leaders of tomorrow, but the leaders of today, right? And we have to build, we have to build up young people, right? Um, not just to vote, but to, to, to really, you know, ensure that they understand power and privilege, understand issues, understand oppression, and understand that how how can they start impacting their communities, now, right? So I'm excited about that. They're they're definitely targeting people by saying like we're gonna help with this, we're gonna help with that. But I feel like at the end of the day, it's the youth that right now that's unemployed that doesn't yeah. really know where to go with what's happening. So I feel like that's the main reason why we really don't want to vote for it. But some of the things that that people need to be doing um, in City Hall or Queens Park or whatever it may be is really speaking to people, of, really speaking to youth about local issues um, and ensuring that they're involved in decision making. When they get involved in decision making, they're like you. They now want to do more. 